Early Life and Education Kim Tae-hee was born on 29 March 1980 in Osun, South Korea. Her father is Kim Yoo-moon, who established and is chairman of Hankook Union Transportation Company in 1984. She is often involved in various charities to help out underserved youths and broken families in the Ulsan area. She has an older sister, Kim hee won and a younger brother, Lee Won. The latter is also an actor and appeared in her television series Stairway to Heaven. She attended Samson Elementary School, Dehu Middle School, and then enrolled at Olsen Girls High School. In 1999, Kim moved to Seoul to attend college at the prestigious Seoul National University, where she became the president of the SNU Women's Ski Club. In 2005, she graduated from SNU with a bachelor's degree in fashion design. Career In 2000, an advertising executive saw Kim riding the subway and offered her a modeling job. Kim appeared in television commercials and print ads before making her acting debut with a small role in the 2001 melodrama Last Present. In 2002, she starred in the short film Living in Newtown and the sitcom Let's Go, followed by Screen and A Problem at My Younger Brother's House in 2003. Kim rose to stardom in 2003 via her portrayal of the evil stepsister in the popular SBS TV series Stairway to Heaven. Starting 2004, Kim was cast in leading roles in her succeeding projects, including the Supernatural KBS series Forbidden Love and the SBS Campus Romance Love Story in Harvard. The latter drew solid viewership ratings nationwide throughout its run, with a peak viewer rating of 20%, and won Kim the Most Popular Actress Award in TV category, at the Bexang Arts Awards. Love Story in Harvard was also reportedly well received by Japanese viewers, and contributed to Kim's popularity in the country. Writing the big success of Stairway to Heaven and Love Story in Harvard, Kim became one of the most sought-after faces in the TV commercial industry. She was picked by Courier Broadcast Advertising Corporation as the top advertising model of the year in 2008, earning her title of CF Queen. However, Kim expressed her desire to be valued properly as an actor, preferring to succeed based on her acting skills, rather than her image. Kim then turned to film, starring in action fantasy epic The Restless, 2006, and the romantic comedy Venus and Mars, 2007. However, both were unsuccessful at the box office. Back on the small screen in 2009, Kim played a Miss Profiler in the spy action thriller Iris. It was one of the most expensive Korean dramas ever produced, and was a critical and commercial success, with an average viewership rating of 30%. Kim shed tears at the KBS Drama Awards when she won an Excellence Award in a mid-length drama, which was her first acting award, excluding Newcomer and Popularity Awards. Kim left her then-agency Namu Actors in January 2010 to join Lu Entertainment, which was founded by her brother-in-law. That year, she also played a horse jockey who dreams of winning the championship in the sports film Grand Prix. After the success of Iris, she again drew positive reviews in the romantic comedy series My Princess. 2011, Kim played an ordinary college student who discovers that she is Korean royalty. Later that year, she starred in her first Japanese television drama Boku to star number 99 Nichi, where her character is a Korean wave star who meets an ordinary Japanese bodyguard, and he somehow makes her full head over heels in love with him. The Fuji TV drama, which aired in Japan from October to December in 2011, raked in 9-10% of viewers' ratings on average, launching Kim into a household name in Japan. Kim later encountered backlash from some Japanese netizens for allegedly promoting South Korea's claim in the Liancourt Rocks dispute during her 2005 trip to Switzerland as Goodwill Ambassadors. In 2013, Kim starred in her first historical drama Dang Okayun, living by love as the infamous royal concubine Wee Bin Jang. This was followed by another period role as the wife of famed Chinese calligrapher Wang Zizhi in the Chinese television drama Saint Wang Zizhi. Kim returned to Korean television in 2015, playing an heiress who recovers from a coma with the help of a doctor for hire, the titular Young Pal. The show garnered strong ratings, and Kim won a Top Excellence Acting Award from the Korea Drama Awards. In 2019, Kim returned to television in the family drama series Hi Bye, Mama. Personal Life In September 2012, Kim started dating South Korean singer-actor Rain. They married on January 19, 2017. On May 23, 2017, Kim's agency, Lu Entertainment, announced that Kim was pregnant with their first child. She gave birth to a daughter on October 25, 2017. In February 2019, Kim announced she was expecting again. On September 19, 2019, she gave birth to the couple's second daughter. Kim is a practicing Catholic.